Alan Neckman, a bullseye option, joins us now for the trader rundown. And Alan, such a somber trading day yesterday. Yeah, that was exactly my sentiment. Uh, somber uh, session, but uh, the markets go on and we made new all-time highs once again. Which was unbelievable. So how do you come into the trading day today? Well, I'm still obviously very, very bullish. You know, the uh, stock market has been positive uh, on the day, on the week, on the month, on the quarter. And we had now that six consecutive months, if you look at September, both the Dow and the S&P have been positive. So trying to pick the top is a silly business. It really is. Now, do you have a trade of the day today that you're I watching? I like Target. Again, you do. it's about just beating down. Uh, depressed stock target has been long forgotten about they used to be somebody in our trading world if you remember Target, Target uh, trading between 50 and 60 now so Alan do you think that the holidays will make a difference for this stock very possibly I don't know what the catalyst is gonna be but look for it to have a push above 60 one more time uh, if it does so then then we'll be looking at 65 uh, you got to remember that the lows that were made this summer are my favorite technical indicator. We saw bullish divergence. We made new lows, but we did not make new highs in volatility. That's a sign that a bottom is in, and that's been very much the case. I've been cautious because this, this stock has suffered so much, but Absolutely. now this confirmation above 60 is very much a positive. And of course, Target's doing a lot of heavy duty hiring right. going into the holidays. Exactly. I'm looking at the April call. April option has more than six months of time. I'm looking at the 55 calls, which are trading about $6, so it's $5 in the money. It's got some time. Uh, and if we do get to that 65 level, that option will almost double in value. So that's what I'm looking for to happen. Well, thank you so much and have a safe trading day. Thank you.